Oh, there you go. Good, good, good. The men and women gathered on Phillips Lake today come from a number of different backgrounds. Some are firefighters, others EMTs and rescue workers, others work in construction. But in their spare time, they are all members of the Penobscot County Dive Team. Unpaid volunteers who have come here this weekend for one simple reason. Maine is cold half the time, so we want to be ready all the time. We need to be ready to dive through the ice. Dave Sinclair is the group's instructor. He is helping people master the communication necessary between the diver and the tender, the person whose rope connects the diver to the surface. They communicate with each other by tugging on the rope. Building the trust this relationship requires takes time. But dive team members have a head start. This is nice because these fellows operate as a team rather than bringing individuals in from different places. So they're used to training together. So it's going pretty smoothly. Despite the long odds one would seem to face after falling into one of Maine's frigid lakes or ponds, the goal of the Penobscot County dive team is rescue, not recovery. There have been uh, cases where people have been recovered, especially in cold water. Uh, your system starts to shut down and slow down, and people have been, re been recovered uh, up to an hour, and I guess even beyond that. Members of the state police and Maine Game Wardens dive team were also on hand today to observe. Today, you know, come and see how they train and, uh, you know, pass ideas back and forth. And, uh, you know, it's a good thing, cooperation. Everybody's doing the same thing. All people who are learning and honing a special skill that could save your life. Steve Lacey, ABC7, Lucerne.